live, baby. We're live, live. baby. We are live. Oh. We kind of figured it out. We're going to do Star Wars. Oh, what? Bridge Man. Star Bridge Wars. Man. Bridge Man. Bridge Man. Bridge Man. Hmm. So it turns out getting this game to work on multiple platforms requires uh, training within Starfleet, actually. Like, we yeah. actually had to go through... Uh, you have to go to Ubisoft's school of menu design. <laughs> 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 uh, That's our first good burn. So, <laughs> so what we can promise right now... Whoa, is this an RPG? Please tell me I can move Donald around in this world. Find all the coins listed on the coin holder, then return to this rally station. And the rally is over. Holy cow. Oh. Look at that sprite. This is good. And that's Donald's home. There's a memo. I am at the Tetris coin rally. This year, I have coin number three. I welcome all challenges from Tetris experts. Sincerely, Donald. <laughs> oh, that's a good sprite. Uh, you know, one of the reasons I... <laughs> I sound like such a serial killer. One of the reasons I fell in love with Friday the 13th to begin with is because Jason Voorhees murders and kills people the most creatively and the the best. He's how do you the, how do you kill someone the no, best? You showed me he picks somebody up and throws them into a TV. That's not creative. That's that's one out of over 100 know, kills. That's, that's yeah. the one you showed that's me. That's a really good one. Too. Okay. <laughs> oh, you're you're forgetting the first part of that kill, Kyle, I, where I, I, he buries the axe in her head <laughs> and then throws her body with the axe in the head into the TV. Okay, all right, all right. So, <laughs> all right, we're throwing the body into the TV. Yeah. Okay. It's a good throw. Check it out. Part seven. When the body, when the body goes into the TV, yeah. is it like? It's like a flop. Yeah. Dude. How, so does, it, does it like go through the TV and then crash no. to the ground? How does it work? Like crashes over. Okay. Like, yeah. yeah. Okay. Good kill. So Jason is a is a master of kills. He's. It's on the sky dog. Dog. Oh man. Six. Uh, <laughs> I'm petting Sophie, monkey gnome. Thank you. Oh, we got a new one. My Dixie wrecked. You're a subscriber. <laughs> <laughs> now. They got you, Joe. They got you. And they did. Three months. Do you not know what you just said? <laughs> Referral boy. No. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> God, I'm so that is that is classic. You know what's great? You know what I love? Simpsons Moe's yeah. Tavern right there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, oh, wait, wait. Come on. we gotta go offline for a second. So, gotta come up with a bet. Bethesda's now the third press conference of E3. That's crazy. Yeah. Uh, this will be happening Sunday, June 11th at 9 p.m. Pacific time. That was just changed within the last yeah. week. It was 7 p.m. Yes. Now 9 p.m. No reason given. True. Uh, you want my conspiracy theory? <laughs> yes. It's a celebrity. It's it, somebody that they wanted to have there, and they're like, "Oh, I gotta. I'm gonna be in Paris that morning." Oh, and, can we uh, delay sorry. it? Can we? Can we need you. Can we delay it two yeah, hours? Can we just, yeah, it's, can a, it's a Kobe hours? Bryant situation. Yeah. You're like, no. Ashton Kutcher. It's Ashton. The star. Yeah. Ashton Kutcher was oh, on The Bachelorette. Evil Within, too. Wait. Last night. Uh, wait. <laughs> He's around. He's in town. Wait, what? Ashton Kutcher was on Bachelorette. Why? It's him and Mila Kunis. They're, they, big, they're big fans. Are they a thing? Oh. Yeah, they're together. What? Yeah. Those two are together? Yeah. Back from the 70s. <laughs> the 70s show. It was destined. I could tell. Yeah. I could tell. The first moment I you saw those two in a Kyle. scene, yeah. I knew it. You knew. The chemistry. I, I said, there's a chemistry between It's too two. natural. <laughs> this boy, he's probably going to end up with Demi Moore for probably like six years. <laughs> but, but then it's going to end. Eventually, that's going to end. He'll be back with her. I could tell. He says, hey, allies. <laughs> the song, This Sacred Line from Silent Hill Homecoming. It came out of my playlist the other day. While an enjoyable song to listen to on its own, the lyrics really stood out to me as they deal with the twist of the game so literally it might be considered a spoiler. This is probably a bad spur of the moment question, but I'm curious if there's a lyrical song written for a video game that also stands out to you or is a favorite that would not have the same meaning if it didn't have the context of the game behind it. Um, I think I think Nier does a pretty good job of that. Nier, dude. Yes. Yeah. Are when they had things that characters say become part of the music, so cool. Man, I, I played Nier with the music off because it's too intense. You are just a bad kind of. person. <laughs> what do you so mean what, you play with the music? Are you serious? Kyle, why would you say Kyle's that out loud in front of Ben's presence? Why Kyle's does you say that? So out? sometimes I'll get to a new environment and I'm like, well, I wonder what this sounds like. But oh, then like so the odd. music is like oh. too. And Huber, I don't know if you've heard the music. It's like too intense. Oh, you're lying yeah. right now. 
Are you being serious? I, I, I do not believe this. I, I actually don't believe this. this it's dead best, it's like one of the best you. parts ben, of the game. Ben, it's kick, like, kick Kyle. Kick the him. music is too emotionally like intense I for me. So do I, not I, believe you this What time, are you Kyle. talking about? <laughs> Kyle. I don't believe you. <laughs> I'm trying to get that going. Friday night. Thank you to everybody on Patreon.com that voted for uh, Winnie the Pooh. I think that would have been a good stream as well, but I think after all the stress, you j you just threw a, a wadded up paper towel in the recycling bin here. I, I just, realized it after I, I threw it. Just I just threw it. As soon as I threw it, I realized it. Hey, I'm going to go on and 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 on Nidhogg. That's yeah, <laughs> the boss. Alright, inside. I don't know where Iceman's going. Maybe this one troll. Okay. <laughs> well. Nice. Uh, take him back to the other side. <laughs> oh man. Is that what it's like playing with me? I bet it is. <laughs> I'm usually the butt of that chair. I'm trolling there too. What? Oh, it's so cool. Get back here. You will not escape. What is this? Frederick! Slave Frederick. trader. Buy a slave and free- we can buy Frederick. Attack the slaver scum. Ignore the sl yo, we can do- I am Khaleesi. Sometimes if you attack- Khaleesi does not ignore slaves. Sometimes though if you attack, so, they'll like- Yeah, they might- They'll give in. So they might kinda, give in. There's a risk there. So we can get Frederick I am free? the breaker of you chains. You buy Frederick, or <laughs> you could possibly- That's a high price. <laughs> I do not tolerate this. Say hello to my dragons. <laughs> a lot of ones and twos. Here now. Oh crap! Spencer's down. Bam, Bam. assholes. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. <laughs> yeah. So, I don't know how we handle this. Microsoft's Beam has become Mixer, and I don't know if this is a big story yet, or like, is this? Is this a big deal? Is this something worthy of being on our podcast? I'm never sure. This might be future news. So, Beam is Microsoft's Twitch. Got it. Microsoft says, hey, we can do Twitch. We First do I've heard of it. 4K, maybe. <laughs> First I've heard of it. Is okay. it really? Yeah. Thank God, John. Uh, so I was like, oh, that look was loom. hilarious. Yeah. yeah. Was, oh, that was, I mean, just really want to unpack that for people <laughs> that are just listening. Mm -hmm. It was, it was like, <laughs> yeah. you ever see the guy who drew like the word true, but it also is false. Like, it, like, like, like some person like in pencil, like yeah. drew the word that could be both. Yeah. It could be false or could be true. I can't tell. Um, like Huber gave me a look that was both like, what do you think? And yeah. I have no idea yeah. what the hell this <laughs> no is. No idea. Look. That was a good look. Uh, Jones, I'll tell you, you have heard of it because they brought it up at E3 last year. We're, we're integrating Beam into the Xbox One. You'll be able to watch live streams and stream live from. And they got Xbox Bing also, One. which I've never touched. So yeah. Uh, the other night I had some chest pains too because <laughs> I'm presuming that Dragon Quest XI is coming to the West, but that has not been announced yet, and it's like so oh, it's you're coming. Chest pains. Like, yeah, because <laughs> Dragon Quest Ten Palpitations. Is, Dragon Quest Ten just got announced for like PS4 and Switch. It's not. We're we're not gonna write home about this, you know. Ooh, I just got all the coins. Here's the thing, though. You know me. You know who I am. You put a secret island in your game, Mickey. Mickey, no, 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 no. Mickey, no, no. Mickey, not now, dude. I should have said no. There we go. <laughs> Donald's like, I win. Great job, but I bet you can't beat me again. I'm Mickey, I have no interest. Don't need the coin, but I love taking coins away from Mickey. No! No! 
no. <laughs> no. Oh, no. Pete. Pete. <laughs> Pete. Ian, you've got nice hands. Bless you. This, this thing definitely like was sitting by a cat. I cannot wear this thing anymore. Better wear your cat man. Like for real. I'm a I'm cat dying. man. I'm dying. Man. 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 All right, we should be able to scan it. Somebody let a cat in the ship. We should be able Jones, to scan it. Jones, it's in range. Scan it. I'd love to. I scan it, Jones. Kyle, maybe go to the PC and look at, see what I'm seeing, and tell me what to do. Jones, scan that thing. I would use a scanner, I guess, Jones. Yeah, I think there's a scanner. <laughs> Some kind of scan device. If it says I'm tactical... I'm just gonna sit here for the next uh, hour and a half. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, dude. <laughs> yes. Yes. Effective. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit of backup would be rad. Oh my gosh. Awesome. Jones, look for, look for the thing that says scan. <laughs> Jones, for real, can we switch? Can I be five? Yeah. You know. uh, oh, this is unprecedented. Look at this, everybody. I like, can't wear that thing. Consciousness swapping right before your very eyes, only enabled by PR. Look at this. They do. Just announcing it for me. Yeah. If it's, uh, just, I love Dishonored too. Oh my god, Dishonored's Kyle, dude, level design. Mm -hmm. How many times have I told you? I know. Come on, man. We'll do it. We'll do a satellite stream. Please. We'll do it. Yeah, yeah. Please, pre please. We'll do the stream. Okay. Where you have to like demonstrate here's what's good about the level design. It would be like if you came to me and yeah. you and this is the equivalent, okay? okay. Uh, us showing you Dishonored 2's level design mm -hmm. would be like you coming to me one day mm -hmm. saying, Huber, check out this movie. There's some really good kills. <laughs> <laughs> but why would I ever do that? Would you trust me to find a good kills movie? If you came to me and were like, yo, dude, check these kills out. I'd be like, whoa. <laughs> All right. I'll cue it up. And it's like Vanilla Sky. It's like, that, it's like the, the pillow suffocating scene. It's like, isn't this cool, Huber? And you're like, no, th dude, this is awful. <laughs> you were isn't this one cool? You're like Kyle, what's uh, up? I think dude? What is, <laughs> I think Dishonored Two has very good level design too. Okay, so right. best in the biz. Yeah, so I expect to see that uh, a new Bethesda <laughs> IP. We Ooh. know they're working on one. Ooh. Wow. <laughs> I'm Word is Pete plans to do something evil. If oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> all right that is very funny we did not get that implication at all in the ending before I have one. I got one. Finally. Do it. It took me a long time to remember this. There was a time when I thought I was too mature for Grand Theft Auto Five. Five. That Grand five. Theft Auto Five, five was a silly <laughs> game was a for silly children. Oh no. Seventeen-year-olds might enjoy this, but not me. Oh no. I was convinced by one Michael P. Huber, the convincer. To give Grand Theft Auto V a shot. Dude, I remember this. And while I still do find many elements of yeah. it juvenile, <laughs> okay. I love my time <laughs> yes. in that game. Had you played Grand Theft Auto before 5? I watched my roommate play 4, sitting okay. on the couch, looking at it like, this is dumb. People like this? They're dumb idiots. This is dumb. <laughs> <laughs> I, and I think that's, a, that's an important point because yeah. a game can look dumb, but you you really don't know until you get your hands on it. Mm -hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. I mean, some, sometimes you do, but... Yep. That's it. We're all done. Cool. We're all done with this episode of Frame Trap. Had you Thank played you Red watching. Dead before GTA 5? I got to Red Dead, got to Mexico, quit. <laughs> okay. Why do you, like, I, why? 
Yes! So Why? We're yeah. so close! Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was just like, oh, cool, we're guys, so you gave it a yeah. chance and you liked we're it. so close! And then you just gotta Why do the I thing with that? the Red Dead. We talk about trading in games. Oh. We talk about trading in games. I don't think I've shared this before. Oh, no. I've shared my love of this game before. To cr got Red Dead Redemption, you know what I mean? Played it, got to Mexico, I was like, oh, is this more? Okay. Done. Put it back in the case. Take it back to GameStop. Trade that in. Four. Another Western themed game. Toy Story 3. Great. Baby. Great. Game. And I loved Good it. Good way to end it. It Toy was Story filthy. Three. It felt yeah. dirty and I loved it. Played through Toy Story 3 yeah. instead of Red Dead Redemption. It was disgusting. It was depraved. And I loved every second of that game.